Greetings, fellow modern Stoics. You've just discovered a treasure trove, far more valuable than the fleeting distractions of the digital age. If you've ever caught yourself scrolling endlessly, feeling the weight of the world's demands, or simply wishing you could care less about the minutiae, then you're exactly where you need to be. It may seem paradoxical, but the ancient philosophy of Stoicism, crafted long before the advent of social media and high-speed internet, holds the keys to mastering the art of detachment and letting go. In the minutes ahead, we will unearth seven powerful Stoic principles that are not just theoretical concepts, but practical tools designed to transform your approach to daily life. These principles offer a refreshing respite from the chaos of our 21st century existence. So, if you're ready to dive deeper and equip yourself with wisdom that stands the test of time, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and ring the notification bell to not miss out on any future insights. Stoicism, at its core, isn't just about enduring hardship. It's about thriving amidst adversity by focusing on what truly matters. As we navigate through these principles, you'll learn how to shift your perspective from sweating the small stuff to embracing life's challenges with a newfound resilience. Let's begin this transformative journey and see how Stoicism can not only educate us, but also liberate us from the burdens of excessive concern and attachment. Now, let's dive into our first principle, understanding the balance between control and surrender. Stoicism teaches us a vital lesson about distinguishing between what's in our control and what isn't. This might sound simple, but it's a profound tool that transforms how we interact with the world. Imagine you're stuck in traffic, late for an appointment. The frustration builds up, doesn't it? But here's a stoic twist. Traffic, like the weather or other people's actions, isn't within our control. What we do control are our reactions. The Stoics suggest we surrender to these external circumstances, not with resignation, but with empowerment. By accepting what we cannot change, we're not defeated. Rather, we are liberated from unnecessary stress. This doesn't mean giving up responsibility, but focusing our efforts where they count. It's about knowing that our peace of mind comes not from controlling the world around us, but from controlling our responses to it. This principle isn't just about avoiding frustration. It's about cultivating a state of inner calm and resilience that sustains us, no matter the external chaos. As you practice this, you start to see life's hurdles not as obstacles, but as opportunities to practice your stoic calm. Embrace this mindset and watch how it transforms your daily stress into tranquility. Moving seamlessly to our second principle, living in the present. Stoicism doesn't just teach us to endure, it teaches us to engage fully with the here and now. It's easy to get lost reminiscing about the past or dreaming about the future, yet the only time we truly possess is the present moment. Why is this so critical? Because every second spent worrying about what's gone or what's yet to come is a second lost. Consider this, when you're truly absorbed in a task, time seems to vanish. This is being present. It's about sinking into the richness of life as it happens, not as we worry it to be. Here are some practical ways to enhance your presence. Mindful breathing. When you find your thoughts drifting to past regrets or future anxieties, gently guide your focus back to your breath. This simple act can anchor you firmly in the now. Single tasking. In our multitasking world, try doing just one thing at a time. Eat without checking your phone, walk without headphones. You'll notice details and flavors you've been missing. Gratitude Moments Take a few minutes each day to think about what you're grateful for. 
Gratitude roots you in what's good right now, not in what could have been or what might be. Living in the present isn't about forgetting the past or ignoring the future. It's about giving your full attention to the now, reducing stress and increasing satisfaction. This stoic principle invites us to experience life's fleeting moments with full engagement, turning ordinary experiences into extraordinary ones. Embrace the present and watch your life transform with clarity and tranquility. Flowing effortlessly into our third principle, let's explore the stoic wisdom on embracing change. Change is a constant in life, as inevitable as the rise and set of the sun, yet many of us dread change, fearing the unknown. Stoicism offers a refreshing perspective. Accept and utilize change as a powerful ally in personal growth. The Stoics viewed every change in life, no matter how disruptive it may seem, as an opportunity to strengthen character and deepen wisdom. Consider the changing seasons. Each brings its own challenges and beauties, urging us to adapt and appreciate. Similarly, life's changes, whether they be new jobs, relationships or unexpected events, encourage us to flex our adaptability muscles. Stoic acceptance doesn't mean passive resignation, but rather an active engagement with reality. By embracing change, we align ourselves with the inevitable, finding peace and resilience in the process. This principle teaches us to view each new turn in our journey not as a detour, but as the very path to inner peace and enlightenment. Embrace this dynamic flow of life, and you'll find that change, often feared, becomes a wellspring of growth and self-discovery. Let's carry this mindset forward, transforming uncertainty into a landscape rich with potential. As we flow into our fourth Stoic principle, let's discuss the value of detachment from external approval. In today's hyper-connected world, it's all too easy to fall into the trap of measuring our worth by likes, shares and the opinions of others. Stoicism teaches us to liberate ourselves from this dependency, advocating for a life where self-validation comes from within. Why is this detachment crucial? Because when our self-esteem is tethered to external validation, we are at the mercy of ever-changing social tides. This can lead to a roller coaster of emotions and a shaky sense of self. Instead, Stoicism encourages us to develop a strong inner compass. This means knowing who you are and valuing yourself based on your own standards and virtues, not the fleeting approval of others. Here are a couple of practical tips to cultivate this self-reliance. Reflect daily on your actions and decisions. Ask yourself, did I live up to my values today? Rather than, what will others think? Practice saying no when something doesn't align with your principles, even if it might disappoint someone else. By strengthening our internal validation, we not only become more resilient, but also gain a deeper sense of peace and satisfaction. Let's embrace this stoic wisdom, stepping away from the applause of the crowd to find true contentment within ourselves. Now, let's explore our fifth principle, embracing life cycles. Stoicism teaches us to appreciate the natural rhythms of life, from the joys of birth to the inevitability of death. Each phase, whether filled with gain or shadowed by loss, is a part of the greater cycle of existence. Understanding this helps us accept that nothing in life is permanent. Like the seasons, each period of our lives brings its own challenges and blessings. By recognizing this, we can reduce our attachment to any single state or outcome and learn to value the process over the product. This acceptance allows us to experience freedom from the fear of loss and the pressure of gain, encouraging a balanced, fulfilling existence. Let's carry this wisdom into every day, embracing each phase of life with gratitude and grace. 
transitioning smoothly to our sixth principle, growth through adversity. Stoicism doesn't just help us handle challenges, it teaches us to use them as catalysts for personal growth and strength. Life's obstacles aren't merely hurdles to overcome, but opportunities to forge our character and refine our virtues. Consider this, when faced with a setback, whether it's a project failure or a personal loss, the stoic approach isn't to dwell on the pain or the unfairness. Instead, it's to ask, what can this teach me? Every challenge is a chance to practice patience, perseverance, and courage. Here's how you can apply this principle. Reframe your perspective. View each difficulty as a test of your stoic principles. This shift in viewpoint can transform anxiety into a sense of mission. Focus on action. Instead of worrying about outcomes, concentrate on what actions you can take to mitigate the situation or learn from it. By embracing adversity in this way, we not only survive difficult times, but emerge stronger and more capable than before. This stoic wisdom encourages us not just to endure, but to thrive through our trials, building resilience that lasts a lifetime. Let's harness these challenges as powerful tools for our personal development, paving the way for a robust and resilient character. Now let's delve into our final Stoic principle, the wealth within. Stoicism teaches us that true richness isn't found in our bank accounts or possessions, but in the virtues we cultivate within ourselves. This internal wealth includes traits like generosity, patience and resilience, qualities that truly enhance our lives. How do we focus on building this internal wealth? Start by valuing actions over acquisitions. For example, practice generosity, not just through monetary donations, but through offering your time and attention to others. Show patience in your daily interactions and resilience in the face of life's challenges. By shifting our focus from material success to the growth of our inner virtues, we create a life rich with fulfillment and peace. This internal wealth is something that economic downturns cannot diminish and that thieves cannot steal. It's the true treasure that Stoicism helps us to uncover and cherish. Let this be a guiding light as we conclude our exploration of Stoic principles. Cultivate these inner riches and watch as they transform not only your own life, but also the lives of those around you. As we wrap up our journey through the seven Stoic principles, let's briefly reflect on the wisdom we've unpacked today. From mastering control and surrender, living in the present and embracing change, to detaching from external approval, appreciating life cycles, thriving through adversity and discovering the wealth within, these teachings offer us a blueprint for a fulfilling life unburdened by unnecessary cares and distractions. I invite you now to share your thoughts and experiences in the comments below. Which of these principles resonated with you the most? How will you integrate Stoic wisdom into your daily life? Remember, Stoicism isn't just a philosophy for the ancient world. It's a timeless guide that helps us navigate the complexities of modern life with grace and resilience. As Marcus Aurelius once said, very little is needed to make a happy life. It is all within yourself, in your way of thinking. Thank you for joining me on this enlightening journey. Don't forget to like, subscribe and click the notification bell for more insights. Until next time, keep cultivating your inner stoic and live a life rich in virtue and simplicity. Farewell and may you find strength and tranquility on the path ahead.